November. I swear it's that like forgotten month right between Halloween and Christmas. Everybody just switches right over to Christmas decorations on November 1st, but not here on Yugi Mozi. It's an important one. It's one to honor and remember an absolute legend, my dad, Papa Mo. All month long, we are going to be opening up purple packs in his honor as well as to show support and raise awareness for pancreatic cancer. It is Pancreatic Cancer Awareness Month as well as Movember. Oh yeah, and it just happens to be my birthday month, so it's a pretty important one here on Yugi Mozi. And it's very fitting that one of the most hype sets of the year, Burst of Destiny, yeah, just look at that. It happens to be purple. What are the odds, right? It's destiny. <laughs> but we are also going to be opening up a pretty special set. You've heard it here before. You've seen it here before. Stardust Overdrive first edition packs are going to be available for you guys to purchase in upcoming live streams. So if you're interested, check out the community tab. You'll see all the prices, all the information. Like I said, the goal right here, raise awareness to for pancreatic cancer, purple packs, all month long, including some Photon Shockwave. Those are exclusively available this month for you guys. Amazing purple packs all month long, including an amazing Gladiator's Assault first edition booster box break. That's gonna be happening at the end of the month, so stay tuned for more details about that. Another epic purple set. There we go, finally got the timing with the lights. Look guys, I'm an official YouTuber now. How about that? <laughs> so without further ado, we're gonna jump right into this and there will be links in the description for you guys if you guys want to donate, pancan.org, Pancreatic Cancer Canada, and just a bunch of other links that I'll be uh, including throughout the month. I'm, I've got a bunch of more ideas coming for uh, for Pancan awareness, so and just all cancer awareness. Movember is, of course, also just happens to be uh, pancre or cancer awareness uh, for, for men, right? So... Grow your mo, save a bro. Here we go, folks. Burst of destiny. Can we do it? Can we pull a starlight here? Here? Can we pull a starlight rare here for the first time on Yugi Mo Z? Oh, also, I'm going to be opening up some more purple packs. Abyss Rising. These guys are for Agent Lamb Chop. I accidentally opened up the wrong purple packs. I opened up Shadow Spectres for him on a live stream. Got my purple packs mixed up. Purple power packs for pancreatic cancer, guys. <laughs> it's a mouthful. But yeah, so uh, I'm going to be opening up th those guys for him as well in this video. But yeah, hit me up, hit me up, guys, if you're interested. I'm going to be posting a bunch more on the community tab about it. Destiny Hero Denier. If you guys want, want to show your support, I'll have the links in the description uh, as well as if you guys just want to support here, support the channel, all you have to do. Hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. Every single view, every time you share a video to a friend, it helps out the channel. We're growing here every day. Papa Mo was uh, another P word. He was very proud of, of the channel. So I was just really happy to bring him into the Yu-Gi-Oh! community. He absolutely loved it. The joy, you guys saw the joy. Uh, the many times he was on the channel opening packs. Absolute elation. He's had some epic pulls. Tiramisu. He was there for the first ever multi-ghost opening on Yugi Mo. We actually, spoiler alert, happened just to top that. I don't know. I don't know about top that, but we happened to match that with another double ghost video, double ghost live stream. Make sure you guys check out how Mo stream. Oh, whoa! And there we go. Our first secret rare, Sword Soul of Mo. Yay! Look at that. A Mo card for Mo Vember and Yugi Mo. Awesome. Okay, actually, don't have my card list up here. Hold on just a minute. Uh, that just happens to be a $70 plus dollar card right now. Or sorry, okay. As I go into the listings, there's one for $58 near minth. Near minth? But nonetheless, an epic Mo card to start us off. This is, I believe this is one of the Starlight Rares as well, right? Of course, we are looking for that, as a collector, looking for that Elemental Hero Stratos Starlight Rare. Let's sleeve that bad boy up in a little hard sleep. Yeah, that's Stratos. And of course, the brand new, another very fitting card to be put in this set, Destiny Hero Destroyer Phoenix Enforcer. You know that was that is very fitting because we just happened to pull, spoiler alert, if you haven't seen the EOJ opening, make sure you go check it out. We just happened to pull the original, the Shining Phoenix Enforcer Ultimate Rare, that's going to be graded soon on the channel, folks. Stay tuned for that. Uh, double Disruptor Dragon. That's pretty cool. I love the uh, 
the gun themes, the Borolo Dragon. All right, here we go, Borolo Dragons. Pretty, pretty nice start here so so far to, to Movember. Would love to pull that Destiny Hero. Imagine that would be the God Box if you... Oh, look at that outstanding Dog Mary. Is that related to uh, Skull Dog Marin? That is too cute. It's literally just like a dog. Just a poodle there or whatever it is, a Maltese. <laughs> That's awesome. Um, but yeah, so if you're without a Starlight Rare, the uh, the God Box would be definitely those two secret rares. Stained Glass of Light and Dark. Some pretty cool artwork on these cards, guys. Very hyped set. I'm getting that uh, Rise of Destiny vibe from this that already had $100 Canadian. So it's pretty decent price. It, you know, a pretty, you know, not decent. It's pretty high for uh, a brand new set. Definitely has, I think, the potential to go up there. Especially, um, it, it, am I am I crazy or is? Yeah, there's got to be a. I'm pretty sure I saw it right. Stratos comes in this thing. Oh, there we go. An ultra rare B Trooper Light Flapper. All right. Our first ultra rare. Are there any big ultras in this set? Looks like there's one for sitting around twenty dollars right now. You never know because these are still probably pre-release prices. I, I just I can't believe it. What what a more fitting set to come out. Like I said, the, one of the more hype sets, Burst of Destiny, and it just happens to be purple coming out in November. I don't think it can get much better than that. Ultimate flagship Ursatron. All right, we're coming down to the wire here. We are we are going to be opening up some of those first edition Stardust Overdrive packs all month long, so stay tuned, folks. Also, later in this video, it's probably going to happen at some point. Who knows? Maybe not at the end. Who knows? Maybe not at the end for you skippers. I know there's some skippers out there who go to the end for the best packs. Might have to mix them in there for you. Nah, it's November. I don't care. I love y'all. Love everybody supporting the channel. Seriously, huge shout out. Uh, like I said, just pop them up was just a massive fan of the community. He It completely like, caught him off guard. He had no idea that he was going to love it this much. Pulling cards, just uh, just all the awesome members of the community, bigging him up in, in the comments, made him feel like a superstar. So thank you for that. I just want to thank you guys personally for that. Um, yeah, it was, a, it was a big help. You guys are awesome. Here we go, folks. What's our second secret rare? Can we pull the Destiny Hero? Brandon in high spirits. There are high spirits so far for this box. Pulled one good secret so far. Actually, the other mo uh, really hype set. Rise of Destiny. Oh, I forgot. This is uh, of Destiny, right? This is a... Does that count? Oh, no, sorry. Rise of... It's not Rise Here. of Destiny. Rise of the Duelist. What was I saying? Did I call it Rise of Destiny all this time and you guys didn't correct me? Come on, man. <laughs> But Rise of the Duelist, um, I ended up pulling the good secrets out of that. <laughs> Look at this, too. It's just some birds. <laughs> That's too funny. Love the artwork on some of these cards. All right, here we go, folks. Where is that second secret? Or dare I say, Yugi Mo's first Starlight Rare. Can we do it here in November? Wouldn't be more fitting of a day, a time. <laughs> Boral Riot Dragon. Very cool to pull one of the Borals. Awesome, awesome. And what's that guy in terms of price? I don't see him up there. All right, here we go, folks. Next half of Burst, bursting onto the scene. An epic set. Before we get into this, though, I'm actually going to be opening up Agent Lamb Chops. Four packs here. Here we go. Lammy. Lamb Chop, again, I'm sorry, actually, during the live stream, if you picked up uh, Shadow Specters packs and I said that I didn't have them anymore, that was the reason. I accidentally opened uh, more packs for Agent Lamb Chop when he bought Abyss Rising, and I literally wrote it on the thing. I actually, I'm not sure if anybody called me out for that in the chat, so that's kind of on you guys. The hell, man. <laughs> Support your guy yu gi -Oh here. Don't let him F up like that. Gotta open the right packs. <laughs> All right, first pack down. No hollow there, but just happens to be another purple set. This is a purple set, right? The blisters, mostly purple, so I consider it a purple set, even though <laughs> the pack's mostly yellow. Man, we pulled this Ghost Rare a couple times, and Papamo just happened to pull that Tiramisu from the set. So it is an unreal, unreal Movember set to pull to open for sure. We have our first hollow, and it's an ultra rare Mermail Abyss Lindy. 
All right, all right. Abyss Lindy, eh? Abyss Lindy? Lind Abyss Lind? I don't know if I'm <laughs> butchering that. All right, next pack here for Agent. Agent Lamb Chop. Again, these were supposed to be opened in the live stream, Halmo stream. Make sure you check that out. Unreal, unreal opening, guys. Absolutely unreal. Just happens to be in the first day of November. We are, of course, late for Halloween stream, so had to open it up in November, but I think uh, I think that might have given us the good luck, folks. Look what we ended up pulling. Absolutely unreal pulls. Like I said, if you if you haven't watched, I know not everybody watches the live streams. Uh, obviously, they don't get as many views being long, but throw it on times two speed there. Started, I think, like around five minutes. You'll be all right. You'll be all right, folks. It's an awesome video. Definitely have to go check it out. Give it a like if you guys agree. And look at that. Here we go. We get him the actual packs that he that he bought. And it happens to be an ultimate rare. It is a trap card. Are there any good trap ulties in this set? That wacky alchemy. Okay, so not the best ulti, but nonetheless, an ultimate rare for my guy Agent Lamb Chop. Actually, just happened to pull one of the biggest ultimate rares on the channel. That Cyber End Dragon. That thing is getting graded as we speak, folks. So, fingers crossed. Fingers crossed to my guy Agent Lamb Chop. Hopefully he gets a 10 on that. There was a little bit of a factory issue on it. Another purple card, another fusion card. Will you look at that? Technically, I guess you could open any uh, any hobby set that has ultimate rare fusions, and that would fit with Movember as well. Flow Wander and Rees Elgin. An Elgin, okay. All right. Nice little eagle card there. That is very cool. We'll take this. Is that an eagle or a seagull? That's an eagle, right? Okay. <laughs> Couldn't tell it apart. All right, here we go. We'll, we'll keep that super rare side. Maybe uh, include it in a thumbnail. <laughs> here we go, folks. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. You're never going to know when I'm going to throw in a first edition Stardust Overdrive in this opening. I'm definitely going to be opening up a few of those. We're going to have a full booster box break of that, guys. So if you're interested, there is no shortage of packs. B Trooper Descent, an ultra rare there. All right, how many ultras have we pulled so far? Oh, whoops. I put his ultra in uh, in my pile, Agent uh, Agent Lamb Chops. That's yours, buddy. All right, ladies and gentlemen, still no second secret. Come on, can we do it? Can we pull? Can we open an absolute god box to start us off here? We do have one more. I have one more burst of destiny box. At least one more. I'm going to be opening. Probably end up opening even more than that. Here we go, folks. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're taking the plunge. Let's reveal Majestic's face over there. Can you give us some luck? You can pull some epic cards in here, such as uh, Yados. So we're going to say Stratos. Wrong set. You can pull Yados. You can pull another epic fairy card that I'm forgetting the name of. Arc Lord Christia. <laughs> but my goal here, I really want to pull that ultimate rare cover card. I've actually already pulled the Ghost. So, I would take it. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> here we go. First Ed, Stardust Overdrive Packs. Can we do it here on Yugi Mozi? Can we pull an ulti? Can we pull a ghosty? Can we pull a fairy? And... Tuned Magician. It does not look like it. Zero Gardena. All right. So, first one down. Just a little tease there. No hollows. All right. Here we go. Burst of Destiny. Still no second secret pulled. Where's that Phoenix... Or Destroyer Phoenix. I was going to say Phoenix Enforcer. Penguin Squire. And a Sunvine Sowing. Alright. Getting down to the wire here. Still haven't pulled that second secret. I would love. I would absolutely love. Oh, Lord of the Heavenly Prison. Okay. That's an interesting card. I cannot even tell what's going on there. Is that his hand right there? Okay. <laughs> there is a lot going on. Hey, Lord of the Heavenly Prison. It says $25 right here, but again, pre release prices, you never really know. Our second secret rare on the day. We will take it. Burst of Destiny coming in clutch so far. Here we go, folks. 
that Starlight can replace any card in the set, so we're not dead just yet! Ice Jade Cradle. What an epic set, though. I love, I just love the fact that this is purple. It comes out in November. It's just unreal. Absolutely unreal. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on. How did I not even point out this absolute gem of a card? Look at this thing. Fengli, the Soldrum Palm? Soldrum Palm? <laughs> what the heck is that? It's just a, it's just a pineapple dragon. Let's get real. They totally ripped off, uh, what's that apple dragon from Pokemon? And a super rare flow and freeze flow what flow and freeze? I'm I'm just not even gonna Oh there he is, there he is again, that little pineapple dragon. Definitely uh, up there with one of the best, if not the best commons in this set, no? Alright guys, coming down to the wire here. Oops. Almost pulled the Ruxin. And an ultra rare Ultra B Trooper Absolute Hercules. Jeez, these guys are a mouthful. All these new cards, they're just, they just throw as many words as they can into the title, I swear. Here we go, folks. Last four packs of Burst of Destiny. We're bursting into Movember with some epic pulls to start off. Magic Key. Spirit. Oop. I didn't even go through that whole pack. Sorry, guys. <laughs> you know the gist. Here, I'll just double check, make sure it wasn't a misprint. And super rare. Two packs to go, folks. Two packs to go. Another super. Last pack magic, baby. Come on. First starlight rare. Last pack magic. First box of Burst of Destiny. Doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it. All right, that's okay. It was definitely a nice box. Our ultra rares from this set, Boral Riot Dragon, probably the highlight there for me. I swear I was missing one. Am I missing one? Is there only four? Can't have just been only four. Or maybe I'll go after go over that later. Our soul, sword soul of Mo Yi and Mo Ye, Mo Yi. Is it like a Kanye card? <laughs> Lord of the Heavenly Prison for our secret rares. Not too shabby, Mo. We'll take that. But we're not done, folks. We are not done just yet yet you know the deal there are two more stardust overdrive first edition packs <sighs> here we go let's rev it up ladies and germs let's do this i have not pulled an ulti from this set in a while that's my call of the day we're gonna pull an ulti whatever it may be if it's a majestic star dragon hey i'd take it here we go Regulus, Tuned Magician, Infernity Force, and a Jin, Presider of Rituals. Whew, okay, alright, Stardust Overdrive. Saving the good stuff for later, maybe? Alright, we'll see. We'll see. Last pack magic, folks. Again, if you guys want to support, Pancreatic Cancer Awareness, pancan.org, in the link in the description as well as Pancreatic Cancer Canada, or wherever you may be. Just search it up if you're in the UK. Those links might not work, or wherever else you may be uh, in the world. Just search it up. Pancreatic Cancer Awareness in my area. Should be able to find something. Here we go, guys. Slip Summon. Ritual Buster. Spiritual Forest. Infernity Necromancer. Tuned Magician. Infernity Force. Can we get a hollow? It doesn't look like it. Inherited fortune. Okay, folks. No hollow to end us off, but nonetheless, an absolutely epic opening. Stay tuned for more later this month. Peace. Pull that Stardust Dragon. We still have not pulled one hollow. Oh, oh look at that! Oh, ultimate rare. Are you kidding Oh, yeah. Me? I told you I was just getting started. There we go. Can you sleeve that up while I open this next pack? What, what do I look like? Sleep Come on. yourself.